Hello there and welcome to area of circles or circle areas. So here, let's show you what the formula is first of all to work out an area of a circle, which is fairly straightforward really. It's pi r squared. Pi r squared also means pi times r times r. So here we know um, a circle. So halfway through the distance between um, the middle of a circle to the end of a circle is what we call a radius. And a diameter is the measurement all the way across from one end of the circle to another. So on your calculators, if you have a scientific calculator, you can put pi into your scientific calculator. Now, pi stands for 3.14. But um, we don't need to know how we got pi. It's just one of our genius mathematicians a long time ago who came up with this formula to help us to answer questions like this in terms of area of circles. So 3.14 is a rough number that we actually use. But if you have a scientific calculator, then you can press the shift button first and the pi button will be next to the zero somewhere right at the bottom of your scientific calculator and press that as well. And that will give you automatically pi in your calculator. And then you can finish working out the question that way. Now, in this case, um, we have uh, so far been given uh, 10 centimeters. So we need to work out the area of this circle. So what we are going to do here is we are going to do pi r squared or pi times i r. So 3.14 multiplied by 10 multiplied by 10 because the 10 is the radius that we actually have in this in this moment so if i work out this particular question what i'm going to do is i'll press shift and then i'll press the pi button and then i will times this by 10 times by 10 or squared it's entirely up to you and that gives me an answer and straight after the answer it, will, it may give you an answer with a pi at the end so when it gives you that answer, just press the S and D button if you have one of those Casio scientific calculators. And then you'll get the overall answer, which in this case is going to be, according to my scientific calculator, 314.1592. Now the question states to two decimal places. So in this case, the answer is going to be 314. 1, 6. And the reason is because the 9 is more than 5. So it's more than halfway. So the 5 will then become a 6. So our answer in that case will be D, which will be 3.14.16 centimeters squared. And remember, when we're working out area, whether it's a square, rectangle, triangle, or even a circle, we always put the square sign right at the end of our measurement. Good luck with the rest of these questions. Thank you.